Okay, guys. Hey, welcome back. Look at this. We're doing something really cool. We're setting up getting ready to build a world here. All right. And I actually do want it to be where this blue planet is. Maybe a little bit lower. Okay. But the uh, blue planet needs to go away. And, um, and so uh, we will... Uh, it's been holding the place for us for the lights so you can see how those lights are really nice right so we're going to move the old planet in and then we are going to um, actually going to group these together uh, hopefully they're alone okay and, and th these moons are going to go over there okay and then now this planet is going to come over here and that is the super cool cloud system <laughs> but the also the light that's a little bit different i think i might be deleting that so well or creating clouds a little bit differently so all right now back to our planetoid this is a great episode because look at this we're basically going to have our real planet where this space city is actually attached and where that is going to be is right here this whole top area okay. now um, I feel like I got to make Let's see, is, are those lights cool? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Do, does it need to go up or probably... Let's let's fix the lights a little bit. Um, also, I noticed like... You guys are really close to each other. Alright, so... Uh, let me just put that out there. And the other thing is, actually, let's go ahead and... Before I adjust the lights... Let's just move this city. Oh, okay. Hold on. I get to do that. Get to detach these stars. Okay. And I get to detach these stars too. Alright, let's see if we have it now. Okay, good. Here's the easy way to tell if there's any stars moving. You just go ahead and basically move it roughly onto the planet. We will... And then... Uh, and it looks... Oh, there is one! Oh my... Okay. Um, was... Now, okay, maybe I can grab it. All right, I think we're fine. Kind of in there, area. Cool. All right, so I think this is probably good lighting. Let's look at, see, this is a little bit better than it was, and. I was aware that we may have problems. Now, um, that this is kind of scaled to the mountain roughly. So this is going to be going off of a mountain and then um, up like that. So probably I'm still going to move the planet and that together. So let's go ahead and group those. And I'm just kind of looking roughly which it's going to come down and spiral around and then go over there and here. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's right. 
spiral around. There's something cool like that. I don't know. I want to have kind of like a signature look on this. I don't know exactly how to do it, but also it's probably going to eh, I think that that's roughly yeah, let's, let's have it be over there because that's great light. Yeah, I kind of like that, kind of. Am I going to be able to make that turn? No. So you see, this is, is it's kind of, it's all about light, so. And oh, it's casting a shadow. Oh, that's so naughty. We don't want that. We don't want that casting a shadow. Something is. Something is and shouldn't be. Could be any of these things. I thought I'd turn them all off. Yeah. It could be this dome. Who knows? No. Alright, so I definitely don't want to be in the shadow. That's not great. Um. So yeah, we'll, we'll put it back into this area. Let's see if that... Yeah, I think I see where it could go and then... Yeah, there's definitely a shadow there. So I wonder if we could... Okay, I'm just, this has always been a very time consuming part. <laughs> Let's try to get this uh, actual corkscrew right. And, um, oh, the other problem is that Space City is not fully done. So anyways, okay, I guess we could focus back on the city. That will go here, it's looking really bright now. Okay, so we are going to have to fix the light situation. Um, weird. <laughs> Is that better? Yeah, a little better. Get an idea of the style. Yeah. It, yeah, it's better. It's got a bright light. But it's fine. I think the original light over here we may even be best. Yeah, because see how it's getting the purple in and everything? Wow, okay, so that is fun. So we're trying, that is so cool. Just kind of got two lights bouncing off. Now I don't have the purple light. I think I liked it a lot, like this. Let's see. Okay, cool, yeah, I like that a lot. Yeah, these lights are these lights are really pretty in this area. Okay, so roughly um, the same thing I was looking at before. Is it going to spiral down? Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. And how's it going to spiral down? It's going to go. about there. Let's see if that's good color. It's not. Wow, interesting. Hmm. Uh, can I come back this way? Uh, 
that's pretty good color. I could still undo a couple. See, oh, okay. Interesting. That's the one that I liked, huh? Yeah, it is nice. Okay, so then when I go here, let me just go a little bit more like that. Let's see. Yeah. That's beautiful. That's going to be the daylight. And then, wow, there's space moving up there. Cool, very cool. And I think, can we make this roughly touch? Yeah, all around there and down. Yep, very cool. So now this is going to become mountains. Lower. But this is where we're going to build our next film and uh, yeah it's going to look pretty good it, I think what I'm going to use to build it are some like uh, yeah this dirt here so we can actually go in and ooh, that does not look nice it does that's that is the darker purple that I was talking about let's go ahead and do a little trick here we go down into this start a sculpt Maybe even get that. Yeah, go into the sculpture. Move it. Hopefully, it's. Let's. We'll take a, we'll take a color sample, I guess. Um, and then now this is cool. We're gonna um, start a new sculpture. Hoping that we have some of that. Because we're going to use that to build another structure here. Let's see what we got. Um, no, we don't want that. Did we want splat? Maybe. Let's go with splat. And I think we have our color. We're going to make it a little bit darker. And then we're going to... Our shape is going to be... Hexagonal? Hexagonal, yeah. That's, that's cool. And we're going to go into that. And we're going to do a half blend. And we're going to do looseness. Well, let's see. I don't know. Can you see what it looks like? Looks pretty cool. Wow. That's cool. Definitely always varied. Oh, yeah, that's wonderful. Well, perfect with that. No problems with that. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, that's fine. So let's just start working with that. Um, I did want to make the color slightly purpler, so I don't know if that's going to go that way. Alright, let's try. See, this is, gets dangerous. I should have tried to memorize where that was. Yes, yeah, now it's getting red. And that's cool, but I, I definitely want it to be purpley. So let's try this blue. And yeah, blue is going to be my color. Let's see if we can kind of... Wow, you just see, it just makes it hyper blue. Okay, what about this pink? Ah, there we go. That's the color I'm searching for. Okay, so I had to make it pink. Let's try out that gray. Yeah, I like that. And oh, maybe a little darker. Ooh, that's super cool. All right, so the, yeah. Funny. <laughs> the color I was searching for was pink. Who knew? Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, so, you know, I'm just doing that, this. So, uh, try it. We're going to make a pretty sizable mountain. Yeah, in here. And that color is exactly what I wanted to see here. Now, 